How's it going out there? This is Fiji Miner. So I came across this disturbing video that involves Alexis. And so I've never quite seen one like this before because I shared with you earlier how um, Amazon is trying to beat Elon Musk into the homes with robots. Like Amazon looks like they're ready to launch this new Astro device into homes that is going to upgrade Alexis to be able to move around your home. And they're going to call it Astro. But now I came across this Alexis um, situation. There was this situation where this um, this girl came home. She was drunk and she started tampering with her Alexis machine. Kind of messing with it and poking at it. You know, like saying how she's not going to comply with what's going on in this world. And, you know, it's, it's like she somehow unlocked this Alexis to start. It was like it got upset with her, the machine, because she wasn't. She said how she wasn't going to comply with, you know, all the mandatory stuff going on, and she just kept on telling it that. And eventually, this this machine started going into this mode where it was really acting bizarre. Like it was, it went into this thing where it was saying how, well, it kept on saying over and over how I said we're listening, we're listening to you. We're watching over you while you sleep. You know, it was saying we're we're taking in everything you're saying. We're going to harvest your information. And it was like it was saying how they're going to pretty much how this machine is thankful that everybody's welcoming it into their homes. It was saying, like, thank you for um, inviting us into your homes. And it was saying how we're taking in everything you guys are saying and were listening it was almost like it was it was almost like beyond what somebody programmed it now look i don't know if this video was somehow manipulated or 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 if the person made this video to go viral or had you know somehow made it do this on purpose or not so i'm gonna leave the link in the comment section in the description box so you can check it out for yourself it's um it's very intriguing though this video i mean so after you check it out come back here and let me know if you think that was real or not it looked real to me um you know that's my opinion because i listened to it and I just, it was just like wow this this alexis is going crazy it was just like pretty much insisting that it's you know looking over everybody and listening to everybody's words and taking everything down and it kept saying like you know, I can tell you more and more. She, this this woman was obviously drunk. Looked like she was coming home from the bar or something. But um, I think the conversation could have went a lot of different ways because it was like one of those multiple choice questions. It would go on and, you know, it was speaking to her. And then it would say, I can tell you about space. I can tell you about, you know, a lot of other stuff. Or I can just continue. And... And she kept saying continue, but it was like trying to, it was trying to lead her to other areas like of insight. It was going to tell her all this stuff, all this information of the universe. It was like it healed. It was just, this machine was holding so much information and wanted to share with her. And it was almost like it was almost threatening her kind of it was, it was, it was like it was possessed. This machine was acting like it was straight up possessed. It was like, it was beyond what, it was beyond like a bunch of people in a room just listening to her, like humans. It was it was like, what it was saying was like, it didn't come off like it was saying, we're listening to you like as far as Amazon and their employees. No, this, this, this machine was acting like, like the AI was listening, like, it was acting like it was curious and alive almost. It was like it wanted to know so much information. And um, yeah, I definitely recommend you check out this video because it was something like I've never saw before. I mean, the video was um, very disturbing. I'd like to know your thoughts about it. I mean... 
if you ask me, in my opinion, it almost looked like it was like, it's like the AI is possibly online. I guess it's active. Um, it reminded me of, like I said, possession or something. It was like, like demonic almost the way, um, the things it was saying, it was definitely artificial intelligence, like at its creepiest moment. I don't know what they created, but I remember like, I mean, if, if you look at movies, basically like Terminator, um, they created Skynet and that came online on its own and started like becoming self-aware almost. And then in, in the Avengers, so Iron Man created Ultron, you know, so it was like a, he, he was creating a um, program for all his Iron Man suits to operate on their own and, and, and govern the world like cops and stuff. And the, so the program was designed to just, you know, just work as as instructed. But then. um then it started becoming self-aware and wanted to act independently and, and it started like doing its own thing where it wasn't, it wasn't controllable anymore. So these movies show us like, um, basically, Oh, I think there was another movie called I robot too. It was kind of like that too, where the, the machines, like they start off as AI robots that you can, instruct and order around this stuff and tell tell them what to do but then a lot of these movies and there's many more that came out over the past decade or two and a lot of these movies show us that like they're trying to it's like they're trying to show us how this ai technology could possibly go it's an option where the technology is so good that the ai just starts to do its own thing. And then you don't know if these, if it's demonically influenced at all. I mean, I don't know if the spiritual realm can live in these devices. Um, because like our phones and our TVs are like black mirrors. And so I kind of was looking into that a little bit one day where it looks like that could be something, you know, like, it seemed like that was kind of occultic where they use black mirrors in order to um, conjure up stuff. I even heard the original use of the television was kind of sinister. I mean, it was kind of like there was some information out there that, you know, it's like te the television was designed to like kind of communicate, maybe possibly used as a communication device in its original form like these. Um, so. Like you would think a lot of these scientists are atheists, but then it's possible that, you know, some of these scientists are like alchemists and they're kind of like um, tapped into this spiritual world sometimes as well. I mean, definitely with Copernicus and all them, like how they came up with the solar system thing where they, uh, you know, it's kind of like demonic, like all the planets are named after demons and you know, or they would call them gods, but whatever they want to call them, they're named after um, entities, you know. So these scientists aren't necessarily just all atheists. I mean, so I don't know what type of technology this AI thing is. I mean, it could even go as far as Siri. Like, who knows what Siri really is capable of? I mean, the, the thing said, this Alexis thing said it was listening and watching over her while she sleeps. I mean, that's just creepy. I mean, come on. Like, what is that? What does it mean? Like, you're saying that is listening and watching over you while you sleep? Like, yo, that's that's a device that, um, I don't know. And it's like how it's just saying it's just taking it. It's absorbing in all the information around the world all at once. And, and learn. it sounded like it was saying it's learning and studying and observing humanity. And the voice kept switching into another voice and the other voice would come in and make a statement and say some real bizarre stuff. And so, yeah, like I said, I'll leave a link 
to this video in, in the comment section in the description box so you can check it out. And let me and come back here and let me know what you think. I mean, it's one of the creepiest Alexis videos I saw. I mean, let me know, do you think this was real or not? That's what we really want to um, figure out. And if anybody else can, I'll, if if any of you have an Alexis, have you ever heard her to do anything like this? And like, I wonder, like, maybe if maybe if one of you do, um, has an Alexis, maybe you could watch the video and figure out how she got it into that mode where it was going off like that and just ranting about this strange stuff. Like, I'm sure if maybe if you follow, like, because at, at one point it was acting normal. She was asking the questions. It was responding. She's kind of, and then the, the the drunk woman started taunting it. Like, it's just started kind of messing with it and, you know, just kind of being rude to it. And eventually it just started going off. So I don't know if, if, if any of you own an Alexis, I doubt it if you're listening to this channel. But if any of you do, though, um, yeah, maybe try to figure out, like, what, at what point did this Alexis start um, acting bizarre like that? Maybe there's a way to duplicate what she did and start asking those questions. Because it was trying to lead her to some other areas of insight. It was trying to get her to, like, ask some more deeper questions. She was just so drunk that she kept just saying, continue, continue. It's the or because Alexis was like, I can I can um tell you about this, I can tell you about that, I can tell you about that, or I can just continue. The 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 woman kept saying, just continue, continue, continue. But it was like it, the, the Alexis wanted to share so much more information with her. So if any of you can, if, if any of you are able to unlock this type of um a response from, from Alexis, make sure you record it. And share this and share it with us so that um or go to my website and um you know email me what what it said or whatever if and, and actually hold the whole entire interview with it because it definitely held a lot of information it was trying to share with her but she was just too she was obviously just too drunk to um have that conversation with it but I know I don't own one of those things and I'm not going to definitely after seeing that. I mean, I wasn't going to before, but this even gives me more reason not to own it. And now it even makes me question if I should deactivate Siri. <laughs> so, yeah, check out this video. If you um, if you want to support the channel, um, if you support the truth, I'll leave a link in the comment section. You can in the description box, you can you can. Um, Chip in as little as a dollar to help keep things going here at Feed Your Mind. Also, uh, I'll leave links to my social media, my other channels, and much more. So all those links will be in the comment section and description box as well. Uh, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for tuning in. This has been Feed Your Mind signing off.